What you guys got another video here for you in this one we're going to be taking a look at how you can download all your Dell drivers with ease now I've seen a ton of people uh, having problems with drivers and they don't know where to get them and they don't know what they're looking for so I'm going to show you a real simple way if you've got a Dell machine on how to use their FTP server to download all your drivers it's very quick and easy to do now most people lose their uh, their driver disk when, when they purchase their computer and it uh, can be very difficult uh, to get your devices working properly hardware need drivers for them to work properly so going to their site here will make it very easy to download all these drivers so let me just show you so whether you're a computer repair tech or an administrator this is very useful for you guys if you want to get uh, their drivers very quickly so we're going to go to the website here and type http and then colon and then forward slash forward slash and then we want uh, FTP and then dot Dell dot com and that's the first part let me just uh, copy this bit because I want to show you something else afterwards so once you come to this site here you will have a long list of stuff that you can download and there is a ton of stuff on here to download so it can be very very difficult but here you can see it's all broken down printers laptops desktops all in ones electronics and accessories uh, gateways and embedded PCs and so on and so on tablets mobile devices it's just an array of uh, di uh, links to places where you can download all your stuff so you can see here the list goes on and on and on let me just quickly pull this down and you'll see how much hardware that Dell have created over the years there's just tons of it now this can be very very useful if you're a PC repair tech to get whatever you need to get to get that machine working properly so for argument's sake if it's a printer you can go on printers and you can find the printer and make a model click on this and then it will take you to the page uh, for that type of printer you can see the printer here Dell uh, photo all-in-one printer say 964 and then you've got the version here and you can download whatever driver you want for the version of Windows you can see here listing you just click on this link here and it will let you download this very quick and easy to do now the other one I wanted to show you is this so I'm just going to quickly paste that link back in here and I'm going to do a forward slash and I'm going to do browse underscore for and underscore drivers just like so and this is another list that you can look at which is broken down into simple sections you can see here desktops electronics and peripherals laptops monitors and projectors printers and imaging solutions servers storage and networking and also software and security tablets and mobile devices now depending on what you're looking for you would just click on this say for instance desktops you click on the desktops this will then load up a list of uh, names depending on what version you're looking for so if you had an alienware you'd click on alienware this will load up the list of alienware just like so so you can use this list as well so just say for instance area 51 was the alienware that you wanted click on this and there you have all the drivers so for instance if it was an audio driver that you was looking for click on audio it would then take you to the application the driver and the utility that you can use to update that now if you clicked on utility let's just say you clicked on there it would then take you to this part which would say this is the operating systems that that machine is cap uh, compatible with Windows 7 32 bit 70 uh, 64 bit Windows Vista Windows XP and so on so that's basically it that's how you can download all your drivers via FTP uh, for Dell machines uh, or Dell hardware. Anyway, I hope this one helps you out. My name is Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk. If you enjoy these videos, guys, then hit the like button. Also, hit the subscribe button if you want to keep up to date when I upload new videos. Also, if you haven't uh, joined my forums and you've got problems with computers or video requests, you can head over there. The information's on the screen. And if you haven't joined my Facebook fan page, then you can follow the link on the screen as well. Anyway, have a great weekend, guys, and I shall see you again in the next video. Bye for now.